In some ways, it's been a typical day at Zigida Market in Kinshasa. But some of these food sellers are experiencing unusual price increases, especially for produce from North Kivu province. There are lots of dangers in getting food from the east these days. Sometimes the rebels ban the trucks that bring our produce. We've made huge losses and have nowhere to claim compensation. The territory of Ruchuru used to supply food to the eastern city of Goma and other parts of the DRC. But it's now under the control of the M23 rebels. Prices of food grown in the east of the DRC have risen significantly in Kinshasa since the M23 rebels started capturing territories last year. Many farmers have fled their homes and worsened the hunger crisis in the country. The World Food Programme says the two-decade conflict in the east of the DRC has left 26 million people in need of food assistance. The latest fighting has made matters worse. When there is a war in the eastern part of our country, we experience a price increase here in Kinshasa. Sometimes food prices triple because Kinshasa doesn't produce food. That has had a big impact on prices of food products. The M23 is a Tutsi-led rebel group that says it's fighting to end the marginalization of their community in eastern DRC. North Kivu province is rich in minerals like gold and coltan, which the DRC economy relies on for its revenues. Some of those mining towns have fallen into the hands of the M23 rebels, forcing thousands of people to flee the area. Humanitarian agencies have called on the government and the rebels to allow the free passage of relief supplies to the civilian population caught up in the conflict.